Ginger Queer Chat. Um, it's Keenan. It is Sunday, November 13th. Um, so this week we're talking about educating people about gender and about being gender queer. Um, so I educate people a lot. Um, Actually, right now, I'm kind of really in the process of educating my parents um, because I realized that I kind of educate tons of other people, but I haven't done such a great job in educating my parents, um, especially because um, there's, there's a lot to explain and there's a lot of things that like I really understand and I take for granted. Um, and I'm not exactly the best at communication with them. Um, so yeah they're kind of the ones i've been educating now but um educate i've educated like a ton of my friends and um other uh lgbtq people um too so um yeah i usually just it really depends on the situation like how i educate people um I usually end up giving people a lecture because that's kind of how I roll. Um, I don't necessarily like lectures, listening to lectures myself, um, but I'm pretty good at giving them. Um, so yeah, I kind of that's kind of my style. Um, but I also use like a lot of pictures and kind of examples and graphs and pictures. Yeah, I said pictures and like diagrams and everything. Um, like, uh, I gave a presentation at school, it, and it, a lot of it had to do with, like, gender and stuff, um, and I think that went over pretty well. Um, yeah, what else? So, I also kind of trying to combat, yeah, uh, try to kind of combat stereotypes, or when someone says something, I'm like, well, why can't this be true also, or, like, that's not always true, or kind of just kind of, like, get people thinking, um. But I definitely noticed that a lot of um, a lot of my education is I mean I mentioned this like a minute ago, but is in the LGBTQ community um, because I've been going to a lot of like conferences and um, like advocacy stuff, and um, a lot of the people there haven't met a trans, actually haven't met a trans person before, a genderqueer person before, um, or, like, kind of identifies gender variant, but don't know a lot, um, and then when they find out that I'm all gender bendy, <laughs> that I'm, uh, trans and genderqueer, um, then I, then I usually have to educate them, um, I have another, I have a trans friend who's, um, He's at a lot of the same things I'm at, um, so we usually educate them together, especially because, um, he's on T, and, um, a lot of people, like, don't realize that he's trans, um, a lot of, like, people come up to him and be like, You're like, on this, like, second or third day, like, after I'm pretty sure we've already kind of, been sorry, that was the door stopper, um, pretty sure we've announced that we're trans, um. Uh, they like go up to him and they're like, I didn't know you were trans, like I would never guess. And he's just kind of like, that's not really like a compliment, that's okay. Um, and then we end up educating people or they like come up to us and like, so can you explain this to me a little bit better or whatever. Um, or, um, cause, or like a lot of. A lot of people, I guess, at these things will just assume that I'm gay, um, because they know that my PGPs are he, him, and his, um, so they just assume, in their words, a little gay boy, um, which is not how I identify, um, because I'm not on T, so my voice isn't, like, that low, um, so then I'm like, yeah, no, actually, I'm kind of interested in girls, I'm interested in girls, and, uh, I I'm trans, um, and then I end up, like, educating them. So, that's interesting. But I really like educating people. Um, and I think there's... I mean, people need to be open to wanting to be educated. Um, 
So that's really important. Like, you can't kind of overload people too, and you have to explain the same thing in different ways or give different definitions. Like, excuse me, um, I was talking to my dad last night or two nights ago, um, and he was like, well, I don't even know, like, because I use trans a lot, not just transgender, but like, I always shorten the word. Um, I use a lot of acronyms and kind of like, in the business jargon and stuff. Um, so I have to remember to explain to people what that means. Um, yeah, so my dad was like, wait, but I don't even know like, what trans means. I was like, I've been telling you for like, three years what it means. And he's like, no, but like, I still don't get it. I was like, and then I told him what it means. He's like, wait, but you said this other thing. Like, and I was like, yeah, because that's also true. Like, there's all this stuff that trans means. And so it ta it's taking him some time. Um, but hey, at least he's, you know, trying to understand it and everything, which is awesome. Um, but yeah, I really enjoy, I really enjoy educating people on, like, um, yeah, I educate a lot of youth, um, fellow youth on trans stuff, um, and adults, all sorts of people, like my teachers when I came out to everyone, or, um, sorry, I'm moving my computer, um, when I, you know, was like, hey, by the way, I'm going by Keenan, I'm going to go by Keenan at school now, these are my pronouns, and everything like that, and I was telling everyone that I was starting to socially transition, um, I had to educate my, uh, principal, my dean of, stu the dean of students, um, basically, like, all the teachers and everything, um, so, yeah, that's a big group, so, I'm kind of, like, the one, I'm the guy who's like, yeah, if you have any questions, like, feel free to ask, like, please ask me, I would love to educate you, um, there's no stupid questions, it, well, there are, and I'll try not to let you know that they're stupid, um, but, I mean, if they're insulting, I'll tell you, I'll be like, well, you know, that's kind of an insulting question, or, like, hey, I don't feel comfortable answering that, or I kind of try to make it general if I don't feel personally, like, willing to share that information or whatever, but I'm pretty open about things, um, especially, because most people don't ask me, like, crazy invasive questions, um, so, yeah, so, yeah, educating people's fun, uh, I mean, sometimes it can be a little annoying, or sometimes it's kind of like, I just want to break, like, why can't y'all understand this, or, like, whatever, but it's fun, and people are learning, and ignorance is bad, so knowledge is good, um, yeah, so, I'm Keenan, the gender educator, um, yeah, okay, uh, I think that's about it, see you next week.